Run, little Juju, run like your life depended on it, or your father's life, as the case may be, because that's the story of Jew Jew. Hello there, my name is Colm Ahern, and we are playing a bit of Juju, a game from Flying Wild Hog. Now, if you're familiar with the name Flying Wild Hog, it's possibly because of Shadow Warrior. Alright, Shadow Warrior, the first person... Uh, swords wielding blood fest very violent video game right the remake that was out uh, only on PS4 recently but it was on uh, PC last year well no they're getting into the platformer game and if there's a way a developer can get into my heart by Christ it's through diverse video games and this is the antithesis of Shadow Warrior, because it's, it's a cutesy sh fucking prick of a porcupine. Can I not kill him so? It's probably one of those ones that I have to go behind him, is it? Um, I can't remember what I was saying now until a bastard caught me. Yeah, it's colourful, it's cutesy, it's just really just nice and lovely and... But at the same time, it's not piss easy either. Uh, come on, you bastard. Fall, good little staglitites, staglamites. I can't remember school. Uh, so yeah, so you're this little purpley kind of pinky panda, and your father is. I, th I, I believe he's been kidnapped of some sort or been taken away or whatever. And you, as Juju, and your buddy Peo, must go on an adventure of sorts and. Save him, I suppose. Uh, there. Now this game does. What is this? All right, I must say, I'm uh, like this is the third level, and I'm after this. I'm yeah, I'm after playing the first two. So and I haven't come across one of these yet. It's like a bonus level. <laughs> it helps if you press the fucking jump button. Too distracted by all the lovely little crystals, and I obviously can't go back again. Yeah, well, that was crap from me. <laughs> uh, yeah, so it's um, it prides itself on being a, a co op platformer, but I'm only playing through it on single player, and I don't believe the other guy who is Peo, I don't think he has other kind of abilities. Um, I could be wrong. So, yeah, it's a, uh, it's a, it's a very nice game to look at, as you can see. I mean, Jesus Christ, the colours and the beautifulness and the cutesiness and just your, your Saturday morning cartoon type of two D platformer. There, the little things it does differently. You know, see this little B fella. I'm playing on the PC, I should say. If I press the Y button, he starts to get done with his bad self, which distracts him, and allows him vulnerable to be killed! Uh, which is great for me. Uh, if I stand on this, I should probably go underneath into a secret area. Yes! And there's another doorway, which we won't fuck up this time. Uh, yeah, so you, by pressing Y, you can either have your, have your enemies just basically, as I said, have a little bit of a dance, and... When they do so, they are vulnerable to attacks. Or it's also to kind of open up doors and fall into holes. As to open up doors and there are like branches which when you kind of do the little percussion, it uh, allow, has the branch kind of extend itself and create more platforms for you to advance with. It's a, it's a nice little feature. And as well as that, you can, as you probably saw there, no, I'm not, I did this the last time with him and that uh, fucking killed me. Uh, by pressing the X button, you can like dash in a particular area. And as you can see there. Which speeds it up a bit because if I was to make one little fucking complaint, get off the lava, you dickhead. Uh, if I was to make one little complaint, it would be that. Uh, it's it's quite it's quite slow 
Uh, I would enjoy a run button of sorts, but then I guess that's what the uh, I guess that's what the the X button, the dash, is for. I suppose. Uh, extra heart. Um, yeah, it's a bit of a challenge. No, saying that I haven't died many times. Although it appears that I'm susceptible to dying here. Another door. Right, let's try and absolutely ace this. That was about to fall in my head there. And I can't get back down. That's a bit of a shame. I suppose I can get back down if I go over here. Wonderful. Uh, yeah, it looks lovely. Music is fantastic uh, so far. Uh, as you can see, I suppose, on the bottom of the screen, this is a preview build, so... I mean, this isn't the final product, what you're seeing here. But it's pretty... If, I mean, from what I've played so far, it's very enjoyable. Oh! Oh, for the love of Christ! Jesus! Ah, uh, sure. Look, that's it. Anyway. 31! <laughs> uh, the... Yeah, so as I said, yeah, it's from Flying Wild Hog, and I'm playing it currently on PC. Now, I, tr I tried to see what platforms this has been announced for. And the trailers and stuff. I could I couldn't find anything not on the website either or anything like that. Uh, but yeah, I'm playing this on PC, so it is coming to Steam. Uh, in terms of consoles, I don't know. I mean, this is built for your your Xbox Ones and your PS4s. I would I would think. Um, now the only thing is that in the prompts, uh, the kind of tutorial level. There, yeah, this little, this little wheel of fortune. John Leslie isn't there, sadly. But uh, when you do your little bongo percussion hitting, you get to kind of choose one of these things, and it'll give you a select amount of those crystals. Hooray, Juju! Yes, indeed. Uh, yeah, and in the tutorial levels, where it was giving me button prompts as to as to what to what to do. It, it did use PlayStation buttons. No, this could be me reading into it, or it could actually be coming to PlayStation 4. I don't know. No, you can use a PlayStation 4 controller with the with the PC, no. But, I don't know. It would lead me to believe that it is coming to PS4 again. I don't know. It's just a bit of an educated guess, as it were. Um, but it's very enjoyable, what I've played so far. I mean, I was going to stop. Fucking prick. I was going to stop playing there after that level, but I find myself uh, continuing on. But I suppose you've seen plenty of juju now. You kind of... You know what it's all about. Let's do a little song and dance, and we'll get the little crystal there. And of course, we have to go through all the rigmarole here again. Uh, yeah, it's a lovely game. It's really nice. Uh, nice to play. The jumping is is all right. It's a little bit, it's a little bit floaty, but it's um not to uh, like little big planet levels or anything like that. It's uh, it's really you know, it's a really enjoy it. Really good. Really good. Um, Nice little game, fun for all the family so far against the preview build. Absolutely destroyed that egg. Eat my dust egg. Eat my dust indeed. Uh, yeah, so that's Juju. Uh, I've been Colin Ahern, and thank you very much for watching, and make sure to like and subscribe, and all that other type of brilliant stuff.